Welcome. So what I have here is I have a um, I have intersecting lines. And remember when we're talking about intersecting lines, there's two different types of relationships that we have. When we have parallel lines in a transversal, we had alter interior, alter and exterior, uh, corresponding and same side interior. But when we have intersecting lines, there's two different types of relationships. We have um, vertical angles and um, a linear pair, supplementary angles. So remember, vertical angles are two angles that are directly across from each other from the intersection of two angles. And those measures um, equal uh, one, or I'm sorry, equal each other. So therefore, I can say 2x and 64 are vertical angles. Therefore, they're equal in measure. So I'm going to say vertical angles. And since they're equal in measure, I can write the equation 2x equals 64. Divide by 2, divide by 2. x equals 32. So now that I know x equals 32, I can evaluate for this angle. And I could say 2 times 32 equals 64. Cool, right? Yeah, obviously it equals 64. You could automatically say, so then anyways, we know that this value is equal to 64. So now I can set up an equation um, for my next one is my linear pair. And my linear pair, I need to solve for y. Well, I know that this angle is 64 plus y equals 180. Because remember, linear pair is supplementary. So now to solve for y, I subtract 64. And I get y equals um, 16. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you solve for x and y using vertical and linear pair angles. Thanks.